you nowadays no one's really out here buying plugins anymore you usually just get ones for free or you get ones that come with viruses so today i'm just going to be going over a couple of my favorite free plugins uh, that i've seen come out this year before we get into it be sure to leave a like and a comment if you guys are missing with this type of content and be sure to check out the description for our discord and website but without further ado let's get into it Starting off, we have Finisher Micro by UJAM. And this plugin is one of those one knob fix all plugins. And I'm all ears for a plugin that's like this because somehow they always just sound really good or really, really bad. So it's always fun to try them out. It's got 25 different effects you can use and it's just got a mixer knob like every other one knob plugins. So as an example, I've got this loop from one of my up and coming loop kits. It's just like a basic trap loop that I made. And we'll just go on these piano keys. So as you can hear, there's anything from filters to reverbs to delays to compression to distortion. It's it's literally anything you can think of, but it's just so easy to use. You just slap it onto anything. I've done it on hi-hats, on vocals, on loops. You can literally just throw it on whatever and it usually sounds fire. Other than that, you also have a input slider and an output slider as well. Before we get into the second plugin, I just want to give a big shout out to DistroKid for sponsoring this video. In today's music climate, everybody is collaborating. And luckily with DistroKit, you don't have to worry about any of the back end business. It's as easy as signing up and paying as low as $20 a year. With this, you can add unlimited collaborators to any track. So everyone that contributed gets their splits. And if your homie doesn't have DistroKit, they can sign up for $10 to redeem their splits. And as always, DistroKit never takes a cut. You get 100% of your earnings. And if you sign up with a link in the description today, you get 7% off your entire year. Moving on to the second plugin is probably one of my most used plugins ever. It's Fresh Air by Slate Digital. This plugin is literally a go-to in every single mixing chain I have. You can use it on hats, you can use it on vocals, and it's basically just an exciter, so it boosts some of your mid and high frequencies in your mix. As you can see, this is how the UI looks, and starting at the top, you have a bunch of presets you can go through. Like I said, I've used this on hats before just to make it stand out a bit more in the mix. I've used it on claps as well, um, but I mainly use it on vocals. It just lets the mix punch through so much cleaner. And at the bottom, you can see you can play around with your mid frequencies and your high frequencies. So as you can hear, it just boosts the fuck out of your mid and high frequencies. And it doesn't sound too like hissy or anything. I usually just throw it on top of my lead vocal chain, just above my EQs, and then I'll put it on the vocal air preset. And I'll just mess around with the mix knob in the mix window. And more times than not, it sounds good. So yeah, you can't go wrong with fresh air. And moving on to the third plugin is the Kilo Hearts Essential Pack, which is basically 32 plugins in one, which is insane. And I know with a lot of bundle packs from companies, it's usually not the best plugins it's mostly just throwaways but with this essential pack you get your normal eqs and compressions but you also get some interesting plugins like the reverser and they also have their own tape stop effect So as you can hear, it's got some really cool experimental plugins that you can play around with. This ensemble one as well is so fun to play around with, uh, with vocals. It basically creates like a chorus for you and wherever these little dots float around, it kind of pans left and right. Uh, I haven't seen anything like this before, especially in like a bundle pack of plugins, but you'll never get something like this. And even the normal like stock plugins, like a compressor, EQ, a bit crusher, all of them are still so far. Every time I rediscover this bundle kit, I go back to them 
them. So kilohertz essential pack, definitely worth it. And moving on to plugin number four, we have Vital. And Vital is basically like any other wavetable synth, but to me, it's the closest I could get to Serum. So that's why I vouch for it so much. It seems like it's the closest thing to Serum that you can get and it's completely free, so. And another cool thing about Vital is there is a bunch of tutorials out there for you. We actually did like a short series on it where I just went through a bunch of different sounds you can make on Vital. I'll be sure to just link it up here somewhere. But yeah, you can get the free version from Vital. You get 75 presets, 25 wavetables to play around with. And then you can also upgrade to a subscription base and that just includes more presets, more functions. But to me, the stock version is more than enough. And this is the main UI for Vital. As you can see, it's pretty simple. You got your three oscillators over here. Below that, you got a noise panel as well that you can enable. And like I said, there's 75 presets, which is already a shit ton that you can choose from. And moving on to the bottom, you have two filters. And then on the right, you have an LFO and three envelopes to play around with. And just like in Serum, you can take any envelope, any LFO, and just drag it onto any parameter you like, and it'll affect it accordingly. At the top here, you can also go to your effects tab, which has a ton of effects to use, a bunch of parameters to play around with. You can really like deep dive in this plugin and master it just like Serum. And that's why I just always shout it out. It's always one of my go-tos when it gets to sound designing in any way. So yeah, definitely worth the checkout. And for our last plugin, we have Delay by Integraudio. Delay is basically a free, like dumbed down version from Portal by Output. If you guys haven't heard of Portal, definitely check that shit out because that plugin is crazy. But this one kind of has the same effect. It has like a granular delay effect to your sound. And uh, there's a bunch of presets to start off with that you can just play around with because I know the whole UI can look a bit daunting from time to time there's a bunch of different knobs that i don't know even what it does but i usually just play around with the mode and the type of distortion at the bottom and then just the timing as well but for the most part i just start off with the preset and kind of just tweak it around to my liking so here's a dry sound of a pluck phrase that i have in this loop and coming back to the modes and the distortion, under the mode, you can actually have different kind of delays. So you can have your normal delay, you can have a reverse forward delay, which kind of sounds like it's going back and forth. You can have pure reverse that only reverses the delay. And then you have chaos and reverse chaos, which is just a whole bunch of bullshit that happens. I don't really know what it does, but it sounds nice. So as you can hear, it's just a bunch of different chaotic delays that kind of just work in time. It's really fun to experiment with, especially if you are playing around with just like top line melodies and you kind of just want to add some like ear candy to it. This is the perfect plugin for it. And that is about it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys saw something new. Be sure to leave in the comments any free plugins that I missed that you guys are really messing with. Be sure to leave a like and a comment as well and check out the description for our website. Be sure to check out for our district headline link as well shout out to them and yeah i'll check you guys in the next one